FBI, we are leaving Henderson Beach State Park. Yay. And we had a great morning. We went walking and we went cycling and then we got back with enough time to um, go do some boogie boarding. So we did that. That's awesome. Still came back to camp and had lunch and were able to get everything wrapped up to move to our next place, which is Grayton, Grayton Beach. Beach State Park. Woohoo! And it's supposed to be really nice there. Our weather looks like it's kind of going south a little bit, or in this case, going north. I think it's going to get cold, yeah. colder. But we've had some fabulous weather while we were here. I mean, yes. amazing, amazing, amazing. But you know that cold weather will make the water feel warmer. It's true. <laughs> but Grayton's supposed to be a great, like, really great place, state park. Like, yeah. one of the best in the country. Yeah. Supposed to be really, really good. So we're looking forward to and spending, gonna meet us there spending a week there. And yeah, Lynn's going to meet us there on Wednesday or something like that. So that'll be fun. And we're hoping, we're really hoping that Pesky is not there. But we don't know. But we're hoping not. Okay. All right. See ya. Bye. Hey, everybody. Hey. <laughs> Look at us. Okay, we took a lot of Thanks for being in warm Florida during everybody's cold spell. I know, thanks for sending the cold down here, you guys. Yeah. Gosh. Now it's 30, 31 degrees this morning. 31. 31. 31. We're out doing our morning walk. I have my puff sweater and my puff jacket on. Yeah, because it's kind of breezy and, you know, cold. Anyway, we're at Great Beach. The day we got here a couple days ago was 70 and wonderful. We were like complaining because we were kind of hot. And then, I mean, the whole front came in and here we are. Yeah. But it feels good to be out. Yeah. We're still doing our walks. You know, I put my Fitbit on when we got back um, from the trail. I put my Fitbit back on. And we're doing like 10 miles a day of walking. And yeah. sometimes more than that, but at least 10. We walk a lot. We walk a lot. We love it. All right. Get outside, people. Rain or shine or cold or hot. Just get out there. All right. Bye. Bye. Buenos dias. Hola. We, Hola. We are walking in the little town of Watercolor, Florida in the Panhandle. Hablamos en español this mañana. Practicing our Spanish. And uh, it is such a cute little town. We love it. We are staying at Grayton Beach. I think there's a breeze blowing. Um, we're staying at Great Beach State Park. We're on a little morning walk before it rains. It's supposed to rain today. So anyway, we're going to head to this little neighborhood that is really cool. It's, it's a pretty place. A lot of walking, not many streets. It's really different. It's nice. And they have this community. How would you describe it, Nettie? That works with like an eco design. Yes, yeah, like an eco design, like an environmental. I'm sure they had to because this western lake is like really significant, you know, a really rare kind of thing. So that when they decided they were going to let people develop this, they probably had to submit some major yeah. plan to do it. And it's, they actually did a nice job. It's wonderful. So we're walking through it on these paths, and it's. Um, it's really awesome. It's really cool. I'll try to get a little bit of it on video, but it's really beautiful. So these are some of the little paths as we just came across the little bridge. And so through this little neighborhood, there's a ton of these little walking paths like this that wind in every direction. So we're just going to explore every nook and cranny of it. That's our plan for today. It's beautiful. Got lost out there in the neighborhood. Just a little. <laughs> wandering around. We're still, there were we were no still wandering. There were no white blazes. Yeah, no white blazes. <laughs> we don't know what, what to do. So anyway, we got over here. We got some coffee and some muffins. So when we were walking, I we, I, we were walking down the sidewalk and I saw this uh, construction guy and we made eye contact at the same time and I went, <laughs> total high school. Mm -hmm. Totally took me back in high school. We used to walk down the halls down and go, so we decided we're going to bring it back. Mm -hmm. It's not a nod. It's a head flip. It's, it's like a, a... It's just a... It's like a jerk. It's a jerk. Head jerk. Acknowledgement. Head jerk. Yeah. So we're on a mission to take it back, to bring it back. So when we see you guys, if we run into you, we're going to do a... 
Let me see yours, girls. You got it. Nice. <laughs> Do it again. One more. Another cold day at Grayton Beach State Park. But the Wander Women found a trail, so we're out hiking. It's a pretty good trail. I'm going to turn around and let you see some of it. Man, it's been uh, not good weather here for us, but it's supposed to get better tomorrow. So, anyway, alrighty. So this is our campsite at Grayton Beach State Park. It's really nice. We've got a picnic table. We've got our little area here. It's just really nice. Really nice, spacious. We have our clothesline. They have laundry here, so we did some laundry. It's totally cool. You ask how we were I was doing my phone on the kayak. I rigged this little wire tie thing around my vest here and then I, I hooked my camera in there. It's not the best, but that's kind of what I'm using. I tie I kind of wound two together. So anyway, alright, we're going out for a little kayak. <laughs> So we're kayaking. So, so we're on we're kayaking on this intercoastal lake here at Grayton Beach State Park, and it's a um, kind of a special place. Yeah, they, they said there's only a few of them in the entire world: in, uh, Australia, Tanzania. Uh, um, I think in Madagascar, New Zealand. Yeah, here. I mean New England, New Zealand. Um, Anyway, and here, and they have these, it's kind of the string of intercoastal lakes. Is that what it is, or is there just? Yeah, I, I, yeah. I think it is just in this area. Anyway, so we feel kind of like cool out here exploring this cool area. So we're gonna go around and um, you can go in these little waterways and uh, and then on the other side, it goes into the ocean. So. Yeah, um, we probably will too. So anyway, it's pretty cool. We're gonna go uh, back under this uh, roadway under the bridge there, go take the other way and go towards uh, watercolor. Yeah. Where the Western Lake is part of the watercolor community. So cool. Yeah. It's cool. So it will take you along. But it's so neat to get out and do something in these little special places. Yeah, it's really unique, so we're enjoying it. All right. It's not very in. deep. Well, I haven't checked here, but when we first started, it was really shallow. So. Yeah. Okay. Check okay. in later. All right. Bye. that but there's a bald eagle right up there sitting on that branch so cool really cool
Hey, hey. Hi. So we're heading out to see the sunset. We finally have a clear night. Yeah, it's been really cloudy, really cloudy. So today was great. And tomorrow's supposed to be nice, and that's our last full day here, but yeah, and then it's it, nice to have some sun. The weather in, is supposed to just kind of keep inching warmer, inching and, warmer. and warmer, so. It's all good. good. All right. women wandering so we're leaving great and beach state park we had a great old time to do it has a great beach it has a great campground really great bike paths um, and hiking trails right across from the park is really um, you could be out there for hours hiking around these beautiful trails and kayaking on in those intercoastal lakes so we highly recommend uh, great and beach state park it was great okay later